All right, so yeah, I think this is a good, pretty good angle here. I'm not doing, um, so I've made quite a, well, moved uh, the 10 supply points over from, um, which was totally neat, uh, was the fact that, so this was uh, part of the Katowice uh, conference agreement um, uh, requirement that the Germans had to send over 10 supply points. Oh my gosh, they still have to send over reinforcements as well. I have to go and check up on that. Um, Anyways, it was uh, Battle Group 70 for the Germans was sending over 10 supply points and it ends up going to number 70 for the Austrians. I just think that's kind of cool. I wish I had them over here. It would have been so much easier to bring some troops uh, back out of these zones of control uh, for um, replenishment with some replacement units, but such is life. Um, what I'm going to do, and remember... Um, uh, Brudeman's orders um, from Berevich over here, the sector commander, is that um, you you figure it out, but your objective is to take the Boog River Bridge. So he's going to have to get this hex eventually. Oh, darn it. I was so excited when I saw this German um, um, Alberto marker there. I was like, oh my gosh, maybe it's one of those uh, special German units that has... Um, five movement points so I could move across the river and kill the river bonus because I want to get this spot first you'll see why in a minute um, it just it'll make life a lot easier because if I I don't want to go here I'm trying to remember I just saw it with uh, in Mandarin Mike's introductory scenario playthrough um, that little trick of make sure where you're attacking and so that way if, for example if I use this person here to attack the Boog River Bridge, uh, who's uh, across the Boog River Bridge, they get to use this woods hex over here because it's an adjacent hex to one of the people attacking. So if I go over to here and just use this spot, that's great because they won't be able to use it, but I've, there's a limitation to how many uh, divisions I can put in up there, regardless of how depleted they are, it, because it's still, um, you have to take into account all the support staff and the structure and everything else um it's not like they vanish it's it's the troops that are you know the combat troops that are dead it's their effectiveness or you know injured so on and so forth anyways so that's a restriction i can't just load up to hell uh to here and then and then nail it so i want to nail these guys first um and i want to make sure that i at least inflict one hit um anyways yeah i was so hoping that this was a movement of uh one of the movement of fives, but it's not just a it's just a landwear brigade that can only go four because that's remember uh, so one to get out of a zone of control so that's and then another one to get in so there's two just to get the just about the zones of control a uh, three just to move four for a river and then five for the woods so forget it if it was one of those beautiful German troops the you know the eight fives or whatever it w that would have been great um, so what I'm going to try to do is use as little as possible. Um, I think I need only 10 uh, supply, uh, 10 attacking strength points. And they get a minus two to their die roll. But if I look here, if you can see them, it's hard for me to see. Okay, so here, even, <coughs> excuse me, even down here I get a one. It gets, when I start trying to get into the two land, uh, it's just gonna be a ridiculous amount of strength points to use and I still wanna save them. I only have got 10. Um, I still got some stuff to do down here as well later on, maybe. We'll see how quick uh, these guys decide to get the hell out of here. And I have to still ta um, figure out that, um, this thing that uh, Meandering Mike was mentioning as well. Um, anyway, so what we're going to try to do, or the Austrians are going to try to do, Bruderman, is going to nail this spot first with two supply points and uh, just to at least ensure get 10 strength points and hope to God that um, they can force a retreat here get across here and secure this position as much like just pour as many people as you can over here that should get then um the this spot will be in a lot of trouble because if i just use that one and let's say i uh, do get that hex um these guys can only use broken train so it'll only be minus one to the die roll and they don't get a bonus uh, for the counter attacks so that'd be great um but just gonna do a little uh, tinkering here and there but uh Things are looking good. On a side note, anything else? Not really. No, I think, like I said, I have to uh, go and see, uh, see that. But um, what can I say? All right, see you later.